She is mates, Judge Rekt here and I wanna talk about Grand Blue Fantasy Versus. So Grand Blue Fantasy Versus, probably the most criminally underrated recent fighting game. The game has everything a fighting game fan and even a casual player could wish for. Deep lore and single player story mode, very unique and likable characters, online and offline multiplayer, a gallery with tons of stuff to unlock, a killer soundtrack and great visuals, a detailed tutorial section that can teach new players everything they need to know to become better, Easy controls, so everyone can pick it up, press buttons and cool shit happens immediately, but there's still enough room to maximize your skills even dozens of hours later. So what happened? Simply put, Big C happened. While more and more fighting games starting to get rollback netcode, Run Blue Fantasy vs has it not. With the offline events closed in most countries right after the game's release, it had to rely single-handedly on its online capabilities. Delay-based netcode was not good enough to support stable games for many people, so the player base faded and people moved on. It is kinda sad, because what we have here is a really good fighting game. If this game would have had a chance to shine at offline events after its release, who knows what might have happened. Maybe people would not play Guilty Gear now, but Grand Blue. All that is just speculation and, in my humble opinion, it makes no sense to think about what could have been and what not. Players should be excited for the future and as it seems, Granblue Fantasy vs might actually get a second spring. A well-deserved second chance. The game is part of the main lineup at EVO Japan 2023. That alone is proof that the devs and the FGC has not yet given up on it. Rumors are starting to spread about the implementation of rollback netcode in 2023. My honest opinion? Well, I think it would make a lot of sense. Dragon Ball also got rollback years after release. Both games run on the same engine and Arxis as developers. While there's nothing official at this point, putting all those pieces together, plus the game getting new momentum with EVO, it would just make sense to do it. So yes, I think there is a good chance the game will get rollback. And if so, it will also get its well-deserved second chance.